Alright. Uh, yeah. Okay. Alright, I'm back. Did I forget to unmute my mic? Or to mute my mic? I hope not. The answer is always pizza. The answer is not pizza, you were wrong. That does change things. Does indeed.
Gaffaw is like a, like the sort of like opening, closing of your mouth without saying anything, like, 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 like what do you mean? I don't know. be. All right. Yeah, that's correct. I'm just being silly. Um. a secret drawing actually it's not even all that greasy today it's just uh, super curly and annoying
I need a haircut. My hair's getting too long.
Is the title actually going to stay? You mean uh, Fear the Siren? Oh, I forgot to update my Twitch title. Whoops. Because yes, because I really like that title, and it's definitely going to stay. <laughs> I told you, Johnny. Stephen McCranny is awesome. I love uh, I love Brick by Brick so much.
Bye, Robin. Have a good afternoon. Enjoy your lunch. So I'm pretty sure I'm finished with this scene uh, for the moment. Man, do I really write like a like a film guy? Gets very sparse in the dialogue areas. Maybe that's just dialogue in general.
Thinking, thinking. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Which is why uh, I want to do some different stuff soon. Because um, I want to do some stuff that's more interactive and more me talking to the camera and, and different things, you know? dropping frames it's good uh yeah i know so i was saying that um i want to finish this this story up so that i can move on and do some more things that will be more interactive uh that will involve me talking to the camera more uh the reason this is so focused is because i'm pushing hard to get it done um as well as uh, I've kind of I've spent a lot of time talking about it, um, so I don't know how much more I can really say on it at the moment. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, I have a whole list of things, uh, but I was saying it earlier, uh, just things like I want to work on a comic, uh, which I think will be a little bit more instructive and interactive, because uh, it's less, it's less about the words on the page and more so about structure and different things, so I can talk a lot more about uh, storytelling and thought process. I want to do another educational episode, uh, kind of more similar in style to what I did uh, at the beginning. Not all the time, just different. Uh, just, just to mix it up a bit, you know? 
I want to do some flat flash fiction, micro fiction, like hundred word travels, stuff like that. Um, and I want to do an Adobe InDesign episode, uh, formatting this story when it's done. No, writing a comic, Ronnie. Not drawing a comic. Writing a comic. Yeah, it'll be interesting. We'll see how it goes. It shouldn't be too bad. Uh, Cause we're, you know, we're only doing 3000 words or so. I gotta get the story done first though, before I can do that stuff. Okay. You have no idea what font choices I'm going to choose. They'll actually be fairly basic. I told you this already. I was talking about it last week. Uh, I want to do. Um, I want to do a ebook version of this uh, in EPUB and probably a PDF as well for the website. With this all nicely formatted. I did, I told you last week. When I was talking about art, when you were asking me about art. Did that launch? No, maybe.
I thinking of? I'm looking for an example right now of what I was talking about. So I know I have one. I just gotta find it. I think I do. I thought I did. I guess not. Damn. I know exactly what I'm thinking of. really too bad um, I'll have to find one for to, to demonstrate what I mean Best way to describe it.
It's gonna bug me if I don't find this. <laughs> I feel really silly about it though. Um, oh, I know. Well, it's not perfect because it uh, it's not actually fiction, but you'll get the idea of what I want to do. Yeah, so I want to do it kind of like, uh, where's my OBS here, so I can see myself. I want to do it like this with like a sort of half cover and then text and this is not a great example because this is all game rules but lay it out sort of like this as as the story something like that Ah, I found it. Found it. Should be in this one. Well, it's not so much that it's um, it's artwork and story mixed together. Just more that it's it's interesting to look at. So yeah, so, weird, okay, uh, what do we got, this is uh, Dragon Magazine issue 335 from like 10 years ago, um, I've had these for ages, so like this is the first page, and then it goes into like this sort of style. No, no, I mean, I want to do the, uh, an ebook of the short story that looks like that. Like not specifically that, but that kind of style.
well, what? I don't understand that you don't understand what I mean by style. No, I meant like that visual style of having a background and having like not just late, like not just plain text. I've seen some ebooks that that do it um, from like major publishers. Well, not really necessarily a border, but like a background and like uh, an interesting font, like an interesting title card, sort of thing, and. Uh, Like, yeah. It'll make more sense when I do it, <laughs> I'm sure. That took way longer than I wanted it to. But it's uh, it's time for a second break. Um, so yeah, I'll be back in about five, seven minutes. <laughs> 